research and I'm the GDAC leader from our Guru Institute of Technology, Katasura. In my first week of Google Cloud Strategy and Training, I learned about the power of Gen AI, how we can utilize generative AI and easily detect anything such as faces and landmarks and images. Alongside this, I learned about natural language APIs, export vertex APIs, palm API, and dived into vertex AI's prompt designing and generative AI studio. After learning these latest Gen AI technologies, I am excited to share this knowledge with my campus participants so that they can stay up to date and come up with some new ideas of their own. I want to share my amazing journey with Gen AI. It all started with APIs. First, I learned how to create my very own public API. Then I learned on the Google Cloud. It's like having my own personal space to store my own files secure. Next, I dive into the fascinating world of Google Vision API. I learned how to make requests for the powerful service. After I dived into the basics of API, I started to discover how they can be used with cloud ML APIs. It was mind blowing. Then, I had to understand this, a way to provide data in a specific format. So, I prepared a JSON file to communicate with the server and use ML model. Once I got a hang of it, I moved on to something even cooler. I learned how to analyze images and cloud vision API to detect labels, faces, landmarks, images. I had to create separate JSON files for each type. It was like being a detector. And guess what? I created my very own application that can detect faces in pictures and even find similar objects in animals. It's been an incredible journey and I can't wait to explore more positive things with the APIs and cloud and APIs. After diving into the world of image analysis, detecting labels, faces, and landmarks, I was eager to explore even more. That's when I delved into entity and sentiment analysis with natural language API. I had to learn how to make entity analysis requests and API calls to the natural language API. It was a bit challenging at first, but I quickly grasped the concept. Then I dived into sentiment analysis. I learned how to analyze syntax and parts of speech to uncover the emotions and sentiments written within the text. After mastering sentiment analysis, I took on the thrilling world of multilingual natural language processing. It was fascinating to learn about different languages and cultures through the power of AI. Next, I discovered Vertex AI, prompt designing and generated AI. I learned how to unleash the creative potential of generated AI by designing prompts and using the Palm API. Then I embarked on a journey of utilizing the generative AI studio. It was a game changer. I discovered a plethora of text chat tools and also text prompt tools that I could customize according to my needs.